Welcome to our 25th anniversary celebration. We're so sorry it can't be in person, but we hope you will celebrate with us. Despite COVID, our projects are going strong. We've had to rethink and reorganize some of our seasonal restoration plans, but our crews are out in the field moving this great work forward. People ask me all the time, what is a wetland? And the answer is that a wetland is a particular portion of the landscape which is wet at least part of the year. And the plants and the animals and the insects, even the soil microbes all evolved for that context and are all very productive in a certain way. Wetlands are all over the world of all different varieties. But of course in the Midwest we have our own particular kind. We are here at the Dixon Waterfowl Refuge, and it took years to bring it to this beautiful, beautiful condition. It is literally the foundation of the organization. The concept was that in the Midwest, you needed a conservation organization that would marry ecology and engineering. And when Al Pyatt and Don Hay said we could acquire this and restore it, many people in conservation were very dubious. But they persevered, they pushed through. And look what's happened in restoring 3,000 acres. It's beautiful. There are wildflowers everywhere. I can hear the birds right now as we're talking. It's wonderful to see what you can take a piece of property and return it to the way it was meant to be. Fundamentally, this is the best evidence of what the Wetlands Initiative can do. Al Pyatt would say, the reason to do all that is the beauty and the nature, the birds and the bees, or the bugs and the bunnies, but even more, it's the people. That was very much who Al Pyatt was, and it's very much the philosophy of the organization today. He didn't want us to slow down, he didn't want us to stop, he wanted us to just keep going with his vision. Right now, we are embarking upon our largest restoration effort to date at Medeo. By the end of this year, we will have restored more acres than exist at the Dixon Waterfall Refuge. One of the things that makes Medewin really unique is the sheer scale of the place. Thanks to a lot of restoration work done and even more to come, you can get a sense of that. So people sometimes ask us, why would the Wetlands Initiative be working on prairie restorations? The answer is that in nature, Prairie and wetlands are threaded together. You cannot have a healthy prairie without healthy wetlands. At Medewin, we are just one of several key partners, each of whom brings a specific expertise and pursues specific aspects of what the site needs. We have learned since our founding that collaboration and partnership is the engine. And it is that knowledge that we are transferring to the Calumet region. Since the early days, people said, boy, you guys should go look at the Calumet, most of which was originally wetland, but then the industrial age landed on it like a ton of bricks. So you'd say, what could you possibly do there now to bring back wetlands? Well, it turns out you need that combination of the ecology and the engineering. And it's very exciting to think about restoring land that was totally and completely industrial and turn it into something beautiful with parks and birds and butterflies and places for people to walk. And it's where we are bringing our work actually close to people, including audiences that are not familiar with conservation. We now partner with farm organizations because we are trying to affect a change in the culture of row crop Midwestern farming. A smart wetland is created by the farmer with our help to retain the drainage and clean the water that comes off of their fields. These are very small wetlands. We have four of them built. We have several more in the works. And if we're successful, ultimately, these wetlands will be normal across the entire farm belt. That's the payoff we're going for. And we're hoping the next generation comes along, they'll say, where are we gonna put this wetland? That's right. Not should we, but where are we gonna do it? Climate change is the overriding reality of all that we do and all that we plan to do. It is here, it forces us to adapt so that our children and grandchildren 
have the kind of places that we want them to have. We must pay attention to what's going on. And the need for wetlands restoration in the Midwest is just unparalleled. What makes the Wetlands Initiative so unique is that you can participate. We hope that you will find the time and the energy to support the Wetlands Initiative. And we really would appreciate any help to make this a bigger and better organization with more influence in the environmental community. Thank you for joining our 25th anniversary celebration. We hope to see you again soon as a volunteer or as a supporter or as someone who shares our love for the places where we work.